everyone, Brother Rip here. I'm going to make a series of three or four videos on this plan of salvation. Uh, being that this is the day of a solar eclipse, I thought it would be a fun day to start that. My Bible is open to John 3, chapter, verse 3. If you want to follow along, that would be great. And Jesus is talking to... Um, Nicodemus, a ruler of the Jews, a Pharisee, someone who is well educated in the Old Testament law. And so Jesus can share some very deep thoughts with him. Uh, Nicodemus wanted to know who Jesus was and by what authority he had to heal people and do miracles. So Jesus was going to talk about the coming church age instead. That's what he really needed to know. He, Nicodemus just didn't know that. So Jesus answered Nicodemus and said unto him, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, Except a man be born again, he cannot see the kingdom of God. Born again. That's, that's a great idea. We can uh, have a second chance with God and uh, have a second chance in life. That's a great concept there. And, uh, but Nicodemus didn't really understand that. He All he knew was uh, physical birth. He didn't know anything about spiritual birth. So Jesus answered said, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, Except a man be born of water and of the Spirit, he cannot enter into the kingdom of God. That which is born of flesh is flesh, and that which is born of the Spirit is spirit. So Jesus is saying we must be born of water and of the Spirit. He's setting Nicodemus up for the day of, of uh, Pentecost, which would come a few years later. Uh, Nicodemus is not really understanding that, but I'm sure a few years down the road he's going to remember Jesus' words. Must be born of water and the Spirit. He cannot enter the kingdom of God. You cannot enter the kingdom of God if you're not born of the water and the Spirit. That's water baptism and spirit baptism. And that will take place a couple of years down the road at the day of Pentecost. And Jesus is uh, using his time and during his ministry to let people know of the coming coming church age which is just around the corner uh, no none of his disciples or anybody in his audience knows this church age is coming so Jesus is uh, trying to educate these guys to what is on the horizon thank you